and welcome to another episode of Mikey's Junkyard Art. These are my eight foot tall trellises. I went online and tried to find trellises pat or trellis patterns and I eventually found something, but I really wanted tall. So I know it's overkill, you know, trying to compensate for other things, I'm sure. But my co concept is, is that we have six and a half acres here as our property. So scale is everything. So if our property was much smaller, these would be a lot more smaller. We liked both things in the garden. So even though right now we're in the middle of April and nothing has really kind of started, maybe the buds on the trees a little bit, um, the fact is is that these things are a bit of an eyesore at this particular period. In the winter, with the snow falling on them, it's actually really quite nice because winter is so boring and all white, and then you can see the color popping through. But once the garden starts picking up, these things become mixed within the accessories. So really quite easy to make, took longer to paint than anything, and uh, I just wanted to have this. So these are gonna eventually hold clematis. Who does baby blue trellises? Nobody. Nobody does baby blue trellises. I have a few places that I know where I'll put this thing. So anyway, we have six of these here on site. Um, the problem that we have here in Nova Scotia is that the wind, it can be really fierce. Uh, we've been through two low level hurricanes since we've been here in four years. Uh, you got to think about your environment, your weather conditions and all of that jazz. And this is something that I found quite fun to do. Got me out of the house. So I think that's kind of a cool idea. And these are my trellises and hopefully you can find some inspiration in those.